What are we doing today, Grant? We're going to harvest soybeans. Yay! An actual harvest video, finally. After yeah. months and months and months and months and months of preparation and planting and irrigating and spraying and all sorts of kind of stuff, finally ready to harvest. Got the truck, grain cart, or auger wagon as Grant calls it. There's the combine. I have to be so careful where I walk because there are literally caterpillars everywhere. Quick, quick donut before we actually start harvesting. Laura loves Krispy Kreme. <laughs> Look at them all! Holy cow, where are they all coming from? I don't know. They're so fuzzy. I like this one right here. <gasps> hey, little guy. They're all different colors. <laughs> oh, he pooped on you. <laughs> Ew. Uh, oh, he's sorry, little bit. guy. You what? Here's our post for today. Oh, yeah. Smells like harvest time. All right. So here's the green cart. Um, when the combine is going, here we go. See, it's got the little auger there. That swings out to the side and dumps the beans in here. And then this auger extends out and fills up the truck. Fills up the truck. Up the truck. <laughs> right over there. I haven't even been used this year yet. There you go. There's inside. What a great field view, too. Oh, yeah. That's calibrating the combine or something. Getting stuff figured out. All right, so here's down the row of beans. Obviously, this looks a lot different um, from earlier this summer when they were so big, green, and bushy. Um, all the leaves have fallen off. Uh, no, now all we have left is the stock and the pots. I'm gonna open one up for us, Groot. Little beaners. There we go. They're hard now and dry. <laughs> Crunch them down. Oh my goodness, my f <gasps> Grant. Somebody forgot uh, to uh, lock it. We just regreased that. Hey, we're still good. Didn't rip any lines off. It's still sitting there. We'll be okay. I get Laura to do my work for me. All right, so it begins. Okay, so right now I'm in the green cart. Um, we just did our first pass, and I definitely couldn't film because I am. A little bit nervous. Grant is running the combine right now and he has a John Deere guy in there with him sitting and they're just kind of fine-tuning making adjustments um, and there's kind of a running joke like everything that happens bad during harvest is always the grain cart driver's fault and that's me so <laughs> hopefully nothing goes wrong like more wrong than it already has gone you know with the whole trailer thing. Okay, little update. It is now 2.30 p.m. And all I've had to eat today <laughs> are uh, two Krispy Kreme donuts, which were delicious, but I didn't expect to be doing this, like running this. I was thinking Grant and I were going to come out and like film some harvest stuff and then we we're gonna, I don't know, go do other stuff. But anyways, we're going, we're doing this, we're going. So I did pack lunch, so I'm hungry. Um, I've run about two full loads through the grain cart, um, auger wagon, whatever you want to call it. I didn't film those.
because it takes a little bit to kind of get back in the rhythm of things um, for how harvest works and where I should be at in relation to the combine auger and the truck and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I'm getting things figured out back in routine. So now I can actually film what I'm doing, you know, um, but I haven't broken anything so far. So I'll call it a total win. <laughs> All right, hold on. So I totally forgot that my backpack was in the grain cart with me and I found life-saving nutrients. All right, I found a bag of Honey Bunches of Oats cereal that was kind of crushed. I put it in my backpack because I forgot to eat breakfast one morning. Um, and so I got that, thank goodness. Also, I totally forgot about this. I have a kickstart. I'm going to go ride with Grant for a round and share this with him. So I felt bad if I was going to drink this all by myself. And three packages of very smashed cookies. Grant isn't necessarily full yet, um, but there's beans on one side and then cut. And his auger can only really be, like, I, he can only unload on me from one side. So I'll pull up next to him and he can unload. Alright, I am now pulling up next to Grant, and I'm about two rows away from the head of the combine, and I just try and pull up right under the auger, just gotta get lined up, and don't crash into the combine. Alright, here we go. And I want to match his speed. So that he doesn't have to go any faster or slower. I'm the one that is going faster and slower. I'm gonna slow down. I just am kind of trying to guess what he wants here. If he wants me further away or closer, faster, or slower. Alright, now he is done unloading, so he's gonna swing his auger back and I park and wait for when he needs me next. Uh, but I'm gonna ride around with him so you guys can see what it's like in the combine. Uh, another essential part of this operation is Grant's dad. He is driving truck for us right now. So as I, the green cart get full from all of Grant's loads uh, from the combine, I fill up the semi truck and Grant's dad takes him into town. Um, a good three-person job. Uh, there's two trucks, um, so there's a truck waiting here while Grant's dad has the other truck in town. So I just fill that one up while he's gone. Everett, kickstart. Check out this cab view, huh? Nice. This is a uh, 35 foot draper head. Yes, sir. Man. <laughs> yeah, nice. It's the mega caterpillar cruncher. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. I ran this combine for like two days last year. Chair is the Harvest 2020. Yeah, it's like, yeah, go set it up for me. It's like, sure. Sure. Harvest is so satisfying. Watch this. All right, so ever since that first initial video of like the touring inside of the tractor cab, I feel like you guys are really curious about what kind of technology we have in the cab. Um, I, all right, so everything here, there's like a billion different screens you can flip through. This is my favorite part here. This is a camera, so you can see the grain. Um, this is like the guidance, navigation. There's where we've harvested. Here's where we haven't harvested yet. You can see the moisture, all that kind of stuff. Here are these little gauges here. You can see how well the combine is cleaning out the grain. Here's your normal like and stuff, like how fast you're going and how much gas you have. Sorry, fuel. <laughs> <laughs> how much fuel you have. It's not gas, it's fuel, sorry. Um, uh, flip me through some screens here. I don't want to reach over you. It's like more... More cleaning stuff so you can adjust all like uh, adjusting Tells you stuff how in there. Your bin is. There we go. Uh, uh, flip through another one, next one. There we go. Yield, yield stuff. stuff. Oh, do you not do you not, do you not want people to see yield well, stuff? Well, you already showed it to them. <laughs> I'm, I'm proud of that. Okay, good. Anyone can good. See that. You know what the best part of this whole setup is? Oh yeah. 
under the buddy seat, there is <gasps> a refrigerator. And if I had any lunch, that's where it would be <laughs> cool, but- We haven't had any lunch. But we haven't had any lunch, so it's empty. Oh, <laughs> Kind of hard to tell sometimes how close you are. Like, are you afraid you're gonna spill? Oh, yeah. oh nice. That's perfect. I go check out some beans. I can't, right. I can't leave my seat. Hold the kickstart. Good news, we just got a radios delivered and lunch. I don't think I've ever been happier to see a Walmart bag in my entire life. <laughs> All right, I was full, now I'm at the truck and I'm unloading. I really don't want to spill, so I'm honestly a little nervous about filming while I'm doing this. Um, but yeah, I pretty much just keep my foot on the brake and adjust, you see that little dial right there? Yeah, that dial, that's how uh, much open the gate is, so how much it lets through the auger. Um, so I'm at three right now, and that's probably about where I stay. I don't want to load it too fast, just so I have time to adjust and move back and forth and stuff, but load in the front of the truck first and then work my way down the back. It's kind of funny. So with Grant's dad running trucks back and forth, this is the first time that Grant and I have really farmed together and not just like him riding in the cab with me and me riding in the cab with him. Um, so this is actually a really exciting moment and it just makes me happy. Look, I don't know, we make a really good team and we get to work together and I'm really excited. Can we just talk about how beautiful this is? I know it's windy, so sorry, but crunchy leaves, harvested field. Find me up. beans so I was gonna run it backwards and try and unclog it that sounds awful run it backwards again <laughs> you want me to help <laughs> All right, we got all the beans spread out. Oh, look at that. Magic. Grant is unloading the last 
of the beans he has in his hopper. Um, as the evening has gone on, it's gotten cooler. Um, the air is a little bit damper and the beans are just a little bit tougher to cut. So. That's all, folks. No way. I swear I didn't plan that. Grant, Grant is reading my mind. That was so crazy. All right, you guys witness that. I promise I didn't tell him when to say that. Ha, we are so in sync. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's all, folks.